Came out to Wilson's Cut again. The tide is way down. I mean, this is, I don't know, almost a foot below where uh, I've seen it, which is a really good sign because uh, in those flats, uh, when we find those deeper poles in the flats, they should be full of red. So, optimistic we're gonna get a ton of reds today. Uh, we'll see how it goes. All right, so we got a good news, bad news scenario here. The good news, the tide is way down, which, you know, in the past has done a good sign for reds. Uh, bad news, that's the place that we usually cut across to get into the flats, and as you can see, there's no water in there. So we've either got to paddle like an almost a half an hour around it in against a really cold, frigid wind, or try and walk through there, and it's kind of muddy. We're going to sink a lot. So I'm going to give this a couple of tosses here while I decide what I want to do, <laughs> and we'll, we'll uh, make a call. I'm leaning towards walking through this even though I know it's muddy just because um, I think I'd rather walk than paddle against this wind. Well I made the call to walk across this which not too bad but you know and again like just right there you're you're up to your knees in mud and it is tough sledding. Oh so kind of a 50-50, I guess, or whether you want to paddle into the wind or you want to trudge through this. Uh, but man, it's pretty tough sledding. A lot harder than I thought it was going to be. Uh, hope it's worth it. It'd be amazing. I was in here two days ago, close to low tide, and there were six inches of water right here. <laughs> now it's nothing but grass. So, man, big tidal swings. I'm getting more and more excited about the potential of getting some big reds down in this little hole. We'll see. Alright, so as we're paddling in here, the water was super clear. And then we started hitting these little pockets right here where the sand was all spun up. And I'm like, you know what? That looks like fish mulling around on the bottom there. So we're going to right here and then I guess we'll just kind of float across this bay. So yeah, it was super, super clear and then yeah, it was really muddy. It was, and I did spook up a couple of fish. I think they were mullet, but right there. Oh, that's a red. That's a nice red too. Oh, sweet. Yeah, I kind of figured they would be in here today. With all that sand kicking up in that mud. Oh, yeah. Sweet. Well, hopefully he's in the slot. We can knock out our limit early and get back and watch some football with the wife. Ooh. Let's see. Uh, look, he just looked like a little rat. Ooh, see out of the anchor? Oh, crud. See if we can horse him back underneath the kayak here. Uh, crud. <laughs> He's spinning us around. Maybe he's going to be bigger than I think. Uh, well, that's a mess. We'll figure that out later. Oh no, that's a nice one. He's probably going to go right at the bottom of the slot. Oh, dude. Well, he's definitely putting up a good fight. Are you done? Come on, bud. Oh man, yeah, that's a, actually, that's a pretty nice fish. He's just barely hooked too, shoot. Ha, 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 ha.
Well, that's a nice fish for first blood, huh? Oh, man. Check that out. I'm going to say 23 or 24. That is a nice red. Let's see. He is almost 25, so perfect slot red. Okay, well, we're going to get him on the stringer. Hopefully, he's the first of many. Sweet. Okay, we got ourselves another red. I think this is a little rat. But, you know, we I saw this spot here where, you know, all the sand is kind of kicked up. So it's really clear right there. And then you come over here and, and then the sand is all kicked up. Yeah, a little rat red. And uh, there's got to be just a ton of... Thank you, sir. Got ourselves another nice red. We're just doing some blind cast. You can kind of see where the dust kicked up right over there. We kind of cast it over that way and, and as soon as it hit the water he was on. Ooh, putting up a good fight. I don't know if he's going to be in the slot or not. Nah, he's just a little guy. Fighting good though. Ooh, no, stay out of there. <laughs> Sweet. Well, that's three reds. Oh, you know what? He may, he may be right at the bottom of the slot. Oh, he swallowed it. Oh. I don't know. We'll see here. All right, dude. Oh. Come on in. Yeah, I think he's going to be about 19. Oh, no. He is, oh, he is right at 20. Oh. Now. Well. I'm gonna hold out hope that we'll get bigger ones. So, but then another nice red. Thank you, sir. I moved way, 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 way over, and you can see. I mean, we've been spooking fish like crazy, but you can kind of see right there. There's that little mud swirl right there, and uh, we're gonna see if that is a red kicking around. We spooked a bunch of fish coming over here and uh, it is probably knee deep right here uh, where normally it's waist deep oh. Ah, not a oh right there that is a nice trout oh my gosh or is it a red I think it's a trout I think that's a monster trout oh no I saw the spot on the tail that's a red He's just a baby, though. Ah, shoot, how nice is that? Oh, that is so cool. Man, he went after it, too. Yeah, he's just a rat. Not fighting very hard, either. Oh, man, you know what? He might be... He might go over 20. He's not fighting real hard, though. Oh, he swallowed it. Oh, no, I didn't. All right, never mind. All right, dude. Oh, he's a thick one. Actually, you know what? He may go 22. Let's see. Oh, yeah. He is 23. Oh, my gosh. Check that out. He didn't fight very hard, but, man, 23-inch red. Well, he's going on the stringer. Oh, sweet. And he took it right there in front of the kayak. Better. Just drifting across this flat. Oh, stay out of the anchor. Oh, but yeah, right there. I think he's our limit. And then we 
can start looking for some trout. Oh no, he's not as big as I thought he was. Oh shoot. <laughs> yeah, he's just a little guy. Shoot, I thought the way he took off, I thought for sure he was going to be our limit. Yeah. Ooh. Let's see, he is. He is 19. So, I mean, not shabby, but not the limit. All right. Well, there you go. That's a beautiful red. Thank you, sir. on the old man in the sea that's my old man here and then we got in uh, cruising tackle and you know some flash and boo um, I've got some that are a little bit bigger but um, they're a little harder to cast and I wanna... so we'll see how this one does This may be the limit. Ooh. Oh no, he's just a rat. Oh shoot, I thought he was bigger than that. Oh, come on, bud. I think we're done. Come on. Ooh. Okay, now uh, let's see how big he's gonna go. He might be 20. Mm, 19. Uh, that's the second 19 incher. Man, I'm starting to wonder if I should have kept that 20 incher. <laughs> there you go, and nice red. Thank you. And it's just, we've just been kind of drifting across here. Um, Trying to find them, you know, it's um, been really hit or miss. Ah, uh, shoot. All right, now we'll get this rat's nest figured out. Oh, about it. Yeah, there we go. Oh, we got another one. Oh, sweet. Oh, sweet. Oh, man, this is a nice one. He's pulling. Oh, yeah, right there. That could be the limit. And look at that on a cache where I was just like trying to fix the line. Man, wow, huh? Oh yeah, yeah yep, he's, uh, he looks like he's gonna be on the slot. <laughs> Yahoo! All right, well now I gotta go find some trout. Get him in, and we gotta go get into the trout. <laughs> Come on, dude. Head up, head up, yeah, right there. Oh man. Oh, come on. Oh, he is a chunk of a red. Oh, come on. Oh man. That is a nice one. Holy cow. And he is 23. Check that out. Oh man, another beautiful red. Well, that'll be the limit, and then we're gonna get the trout. Get him on the stringer. All right, I'm gonna put one right over here in front of us. Yeah, right there. We'll try here for trout for a little bit. If we don't get any trout, Try it down. Right there. That feels like a trout. Although it's running like a drum. So it might be a little rat. Rat red. I hope it's a big trout. What do we got? Oh, little rat red. Woohoo! Spawning shrimp pattern. Um, that bullet pattern was working good, uh, but it was getting hung 
grew up in the, in the moss and stuff. And so it's so shallow. There's like no water in here. So we're gonna put something on it. I'm gonna go through that, those weeds a lot easier. Found this spot where these birds have been by dive bombing here. And right there. I think that's a trout. Yeah, right under where those birds are. Hopefully that's a trout. Oh it is. Oh no, it's a red. Huh, got another baby red. Oh shoot. Oh, and he swallowed it. Oh dude. We got a monster red that just, man, he just attacked this thing. Holy cow. Oh, and he broke me off. Oh, shoot. Well, dang, that was exciting. Holy cow. That was a big fish. Funny, you know, we come out here and we cannot buy a red for two weeks. Man, that's a nice one. Wow. And then, uh, oh man. And then we, you know, when we're looking for trout, we can't buy a trout, you know? Swallowed it. Shoot. Oh man. Oh. Check that out, man. That's another beautiful red. Now, oh, he swallowed this hook, so. Oh man, it's right on the top of his tongue. Let's see if we can get it out without. Yeah, there we go. Oh, come on, come on. Sweet. All right, well, let's see how big he is. He is 23, so same size as the other ones. Man, beautiful, beautiful friends. All right, Sarah, even in the cold. Okay, right there. Oh, as soon as it hit the water. Oh, another nice red. Oh, man. Oh, that's a nice one. Oh, I think I'm, I think I'm going to get him on the reel. Man, as soon as that hit the water, he was in. Oh, sweet. Oh, man. Uh, that's fun. Oh man, he's dragging us. There we go. Oh yeah, another nice red. Oh, 
buddy. Holy cow. You might be the biggest one of the day. Come on up here, bud. Get that head up. Let's count in. We'll let you go. Oh, man. And he swallowed it, too. Shoot. Check out the size of this one. Oh, my gosh. What a beautiful red. He is 23, so same size as all the others. All right, well, we came out here to this cut. I'm just kind of messing around a little bit, and we hooked into another monster red. It's right up there next to those weeds. Oh, man. This one might be the biggest one of the day. Whew. Man, what a day for reds, huh? Came over here looking for trout and got another monster red. Oh my gosh, that's a big one. In the middle of this, but man, check this thing out. This thing's a nice red. He's gonna go 24, oh, 20, almost 25. Another beautiful red. Something big. I think it's another big red. Oh my gosh, he is pulling us out. Oh my gosh. I hope it's a big trout, but it feels like another big red. Oh man. Oh my gosh, check out the size of that thing. That is a nice red. It's probably the biggest one of the day. Holy cow. It'd be nice if it were a trout, huh? That, that might be a trout. What is that? I think it's a big red. Yeah, it's another big red. Woo! Oh, shoot. Stay out of the anchor. is another monster red. What a day for reds. Holy cow. Couldn't buy a trout today, but oh my gosh on the reds, huh? He's got to be the biggest one yet. He may go over 25. Whew. All right, come on, dude. Come on. Let's see if we can get him up here. Holy cow. There we go. Oh my gosh, he is a pig. This may be the biggest one I've ever caught. Oh my gosh. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Holy shoot. Oh my gosh. Check out the size of this thing. Holy cow. He's got to be over 30. Oh my gosh. He is, he is 31, or no, I'm sorry. He's only 26, oh, only 26. All right. All right, well, we're calling it a day here, but what a phenomenal day for reds. We did not catch a single trout, but we got, I don't know, I think it was 20 reds. And, uh, you know, a number of those were over 23 inches. So that's where I got a paddle. As you can see, there's no water. So we'll see what we do here. I'm hoping, I'm hoping we can walk on it. 
that's the limit so two 23 inch reds and one 26 inch red oh, what a phenomenal day cannot wait to come back and do this again till next time